Hey guys, welcome back to another video by Fully Informed Trade or Fly Trade for short knowledge for everyone. Right now, I'm going to be talking about Procter and Gamble Company, and it's basically a consumer durable good company or a consumer consumer non durable good. But uh, Procter and Gamble is pulling back, as you guys can see. I'm just gonna zoom in real quick for you guys, and this is a clear indication that the trend line it has been broken, and uh, this is not a very positive indication of the chart itself because again, you know. This is a three-year chart. This is a three-year trend line. The longer the duration of the trend line and the pullback on it, it could be indicative of even future declines. So be very careful when trading, trading this market. On the upside, the, the major decline was done on an extremely high volume. So it could just be a long tail. It could just be a long tail like this before it eventually reverts back above the trend line. But again, I would really be cautious trading the stock. And, you know, I do like Procter & Gamble. I do like their strong fundamentals. I do like the dividends and the opportunities it does present in the market. But it could be a little risky trying to buy it down here because the trend could sustain itself for many, many months if it does if it does actually confirm below this trend line. So we want to watch the following trading session. Watch if it continues to fall on the following session. And if it does, be, be, aware, be aware that this stock could continue to fall. Don't even try to buy it. Don't even touch it with a 50-foot fall. Just don't touch Procter & Gamble. This is a risky bet. Just wait for the stock to eventually either roll over and decline even further or wait for it to recover some of its losses. And then you could probably pile on back into Procter & Gamble. So take care, folks. You guys have a wonderful trading session. And we'll talk soon again, uh, perhaps tomorrow as well.